focus on Italy, Commissioner, for a moment because there's renewed pressure on the Prime Minister on Mario Draghi today. Um, of course, we're in an environment where interest rates are likely to be rising in uh, the Eurozone as well. And your forecast for Italy next year in terms of growth is only of about 0.9%. When you look at the Eurozone, Commissioner, is Italy your main concern? Uh, well, of course, we we have um, not single countries being main concern. Uh, Italy is one of the three main European economies. Um, it's Italy's economy is doing uh, uh, quite well this year. Well, quite well is in relation to the average of the euro area or in relation to France or Germany. So uh, Italy's economy, Italy's growth is better than the average and better than Germany and France this year and would be slightly uh, slower than the average next year. So this is not what is um, particularly a matter of concern. Of course, we uh, like very much to have as interlocutor a government led by Mario Draghi, and this is I think in the interest of the European Union and of Italy. But we can't interfere in the internal process of our member states. How concerned are you, though, that the Draghi government may unfortunately end up uh, being uh, disintegrated, especially after some of the internal political pressure that the Prime Minister is facing the last couple of days? Uh, would that also cause you to reassess your economic outlook for Italy? Well, for sure, in these uh, moments, we are in a moment, uh, so to say, of, of troubled waters, uh, that we are navigating until now uh, in Europe uh, with uh, still a, a decent level of growth. Of course, not the one that we were expecting before the Russian invasion of Ukraine, but we are still in a positive territory and we are still able to face all our challenges from energy to the climate transition. Uh, and we have extraordinary common resources at our disposal uh, through the next generation EU plan. And this is quite important for countries like Italy with a uh, high level of debt. Um, in this um, framework of uh, troubled waters, and with possible stormy weather coming, instability and lack of national cohesion are, of course, not good news. But again, this is uh, something that uh, member states are discussing in their national dimension and that we are not uh, intervening as European Commission. Of course, we are strongly supporter of stability and we are uh, very much interested in the reputation of Mario Draghi.